In this week's video, we are showing you how we are building our house and why you too can build your own. I'm Eugenia and this is Pepe, Aspen and Lolita. And we are now building our new home. We have been traveling around Europe for the past year in our self-converted camper van. But looking to live a simpler life, grow our own food and build our house, let us hear. Thank you for watching, liking and subscribing. What's up everybody? We wanted to sit really quickly with you guys to explain why we are building our house. There are many reasons that made us take this decision. First, we needed a place to be living while we build our hotel project, which is currently under revision of the city planning department. Second, after renting apartment for our whole life, we wanted to have a place where we could always come back to, meaning that is 100% ours, paid for and debt free. The only way we could do this without asking for a loan was to actually build it ourselves. So here we are, I'm an architect and have seen my projects get built in the past, but have never actually built them myself. In these videos, we will be building our cabin together and sharing all we learn from the process. So let's start from the beginning. Foundation. This is all the sand that we need. This is the cement that we are using. Two big bags of 40 kilograms. And then we have the gravel that we're going to use for the concrete. We're going to start leveling the floor, the gravel of the floor, uh, before we start digging the foundation and uh, also before we start marking the position of, uh, of each footing. We're gonna be doing nine footings. I'm not too worried about the, the floor being level or not because the footing is gonna rise up from the floor a little bit. So in this part that is the highest one, the footing is gonna be almost flush to the ground. And then all the other footings are gonna, are gonna match that height. And on top of the footings, we're gonna be putting the, the steel structure. <laughs> So to start, we know that the, the face of the tiny house is going to be one, one meter away from, from the first raised bed and also it's going to be flash to, to this line, one meter from the raised bed and I put a screw there.
The mat slab is a thin layer of concrete of about 3 cm that you pour before setting the river, to avoid having it in direct contact with the ground. We just need to let it cure for 24 hours, but more on that on next episode.